you know, I got to be honest. I am not one that likes to admit defeat. I am not one that, you know, truly likes losing. I truly can't stand it. But at the same time, I'm not a sore loser. You feel me? If somebody got the best of me that day, that's just what it is. I need to work harder. I need to do better. You understand what I'm saying? That's just what it is. That's just the nature of life. In life, you're going to have people that's better than you at certain things. You're always going to have somebody smarter than you, faster, taller, whatever. That's just the way of life. There's somebody always a level or two above you. And that's okay. That just means you need to work harder. And in my heart of hearts, deep down, I truly did believe that I was the most petty human being walking the planet any given situation. I truly did. I truly did. And then I meet my match. Let me show you what I'm talking about. As you see right here, how to catch the office food thief recipe 21. Now for anybody that this is exactly why I don't bring a lunch to work. When I go to work, I just much rather if I don't eat, I just wait until I'm done working and then get home and eat or, or go pick something up, whatever, or, or catch me a breakfast or something. One thing I never do is leave my food in the company refrigerator and hope somebody don't be sticking their fingers and shit all up in it. I just don't bother doing it. I just don't bother bringing it. You understand what I'm saying? If I do get lunch at work, I go buy it, bring it, and, and then I eat it there. So in this instance, there's a food thief, right? Look what they do to see who it is that's stealing shit in the, all, in, in, in the company refrigerator. That is a popsicle, popsicle stick. That is some fudge right there or some chocolate, whatever. And that is a bar of dial soap. Obviously, somebody been stealing the goddamn popsicles and the ice creams about the goddamn uh, uh, company refrigerator. And they decide to be the most petty some bitch I have seen in a long time. Coat the motherfucking uh, uh, dial soap in fudge, in chocolate, put it in the freezer. And sit there and wait for somebody to bite into that motherfucker and have that kind of reaction that this old lady is having right here above, right here next to me, right here. And you know what? It serves your greedy ass good. Stop fucking with people's lunch, bro. Stop fucking with people's shit. There is a such thing as minding your business and keeping your fingers off other people's belongings, especially if you grown. I would expect this from a child, even a teenager that don't know no better. But if you grown as hell and you doing this, you deserve every bit of this shit right here. So when they come to motherfuckers stealing people's shit up out the company refrigerator, yeah, that's going to be a no for me, dog. And that's what your monkey ass get. 